The Honourable Member for Arthur Verdon. Madam Speaker, I'm honoured here today to rise to recognize a constituent in my area that has made a positive change in her community. Jessica Mays comes from a small town of Pearson, Manitoba. After being inspired by We Day, she was the founder of a sustainability group in her school in 2012. Since that time, the group's accomplished including reduced waste in their recycling program by re replacing plastic bags used to collect recyclable and usable by, with usable burlap sacks. They've also started a compost program in all the classrooms. The compost project is involved into verbum composting, using worms to, to digest their or, or, organic waste and produce a natural fertilizer which is used for their school's greenhouses. Not only did the group uh, get the students involved the educa and educate about sustainability, but the members of the community took notice and also wanted to be in get involved. By offering their help and even supplied the group with the worms for composting, it was brought to people together to learn about something important as well as to make a positive impact, not only for their community but for drawing attention to the issues of sustainability. These efforts have not been not unnoticed. They are now being recognized on a national scale. Jessica has been awarded an inaugural Prince's Youth Service Award for Sustainability category. She was chosen out of a hundred of applicants. I would like to applaud Jessica for her efforts. It is commitment and leadership like like this coming from a young person which allowed the province to thrive and prosper in the coming years. Ideas like Jessica's are not the drop of like a, are like a drop of water. They create a ripple effect. She has said that at times the group was, was just herself and a few people, but that has all been taken to make notice to, of change. Sustainability is arguably one of the l largest issues and we face without sustainability environment in this province, we will experience more issues into the future. I would like to congratulate Jessica, who is sitting in the gallery today with her grandparents, for her wonderful commitment to our planet and to the inspiring of so many others to take action. Thank you, Madam Speaker.